The vast savanna is full of carnivores. They have always been notorious and bloodthirsty hunters. Lions hunt in packs, always with great attacks. Cheetahs and leopards have gained a reputation as the highest speed hunters on the savanna. But few people know about another fearsome hunter. Wild dogs. Those who are strong by hunt, by herd. So how do they operate their collective to bring back illustrious feats when hunting? Let's find out right away in this video. Wild dog, perfect hunter. The Africa wild dog is also known as the Cape wild dog. They live in groups and are highly social. This dog has an irregular mottled coat and patches of coat with distinctive colours such as red, black, brown, white and yellow. On the vast grasslands, shrubs and grasses grow luxuriantly, pulling animals to graze. Wild dogs also hunt for prey on their meals. A pack of wild dogs is looking for food, very aggressive and cold. They must hunt prey for their whole flock. In hunting, wild dogs often follow large herds. African wild dogs are known to be masters of the art of coordinated hunting in the savannah, with a hunting success rate of up to 3 out of 4 in each hunt. Each individual has a good sense of discipline and solidarity. They also have one of the strongest bites of any carnivorous mammal. Watching Africa wild dogs hunt, you will know why they are hailed as one of Africa's best hunters. In order to hunt a large prey, the members of the herd need to have smooth coordination. These wild dogs have targeted a wildebeest. Before chasing their prey, they spread out to surround the target. One approached the wildebeest. A wild dog moved to block the flanks. Their purpose is to separate the intended prey from the herd, surrounding the flanks and close to prevent it from escaping. It is an extremely effective and scientific way of hunting with herd species. And then, before the somewhat brutal attack of the wild dogs, the wildebeest had no way to escape and became a filling meal for the dogs. African wild dogs lead a herd lifestyle with high social organization and full of discipline. This is one of the highlights that helps them to survive in harsh environments with many larger and more dangerous predators. They are a species with a leader. All other members must obey. When hunting, the meat is divided from top to bottom. Other dogs wait patiently, standing guard until their turn to eat. Unlike lions, wild dogs almost never fight each other for food due to this ranking system. When a dog is sick, injured or old or even incapacitated, the rest of the pack will take care of and feed them. When the leader is injured, he is not forced to abdicate. If he is smart enough, he will still be respected and cared for by the whole flock. Wild dogs often hunt in large herds with the number of about 20. Together, they can defeat a prey many times larger than them, such as zebras or wildebeest. Not only smart and clever tactics, wild dogs also have powerful jaws that can create powerful bites. Wild dogs' lower jaws are large and their molars have the function of peeling flesh from the bones. This pack of wild dogs cornered the impala into a lake. After a while of chasing, the impala was probably extremely tired. It was spending the remaining strength to dodge the attacks of the wild dogs. It eventually exhausted itself and fell to the perfect hunters, unable to fight back and being slaughtered on the spot. For small prey, 
wild dogs just grind to the ground and rip with their powerful jaws among the best in the natural world. In addition, African wild dogs are very intelligent when it comes to communicating with each other when hunting. The dogs do not stop letting other members know both their location and that of the prey. However, in harsh nature, nothing is absolute. Wild dogs still encounter tough prey like hippos or blatant bandits like hyenas. While hippos can dive and hide underwater for long periods of time, wild dogs in the water find it difficult to develop their abilities. Therefore, for wild dogs, hunting hippos is quite a difficult task. Wild dogs also have to deal with hyenas who are cunning food thieves. With each hunt, they almost bring home the spoils of the wild dog family. At that moment, the opportunists, hyenas have been lurking for a long time, just waiting for the opportunity to rush in and steal the bait. This requires the wild dogs to be on high alert and concentrate their strength if there is an attack from the enemy. Unlike carnivores that rely on camouflage to quietly approach and defeat their prey, African wild dogs rarely have to use this tactic. They are born to conquer their prey with chases and direct confrontation. With good eyesight and amazing endurance, wild dogs can chase their prey continuously at the fastest speed possible. In fact, the majority advantage brought success in his hunts. They often keep in touch with other animals while hunting. Always know the position of themselves and their teammates for perfect and successful coordination. And it is rare for any prey to escape the clutches of wild dogs. So is this warthog. After an exhausting chase, it surrendered to the wild dog, becoming a hearty meal for the entire dog family. With intelligence, solidarity, skillful coordination and outstanding physical strength, wild dogs have become one of the most successful predators on the savannah. It is not too much that wild dogs are called perfect hunters. Today's video comes to an end. Thank you for watching all of our videos. If you love exploring the animal world, don't forget to press the subscribe button in the bottom right corner of the screen and turn on notifications to follow new videos. Besides, please click like and share this video with your friends and relatives. And now goodbye and see you in the next video.